Okay, hi, thanks for joining me. It's Jackie at White Raven uh, Book Rock on Vancouver Island in Canada, West Coast. Um, I'm here to show you a little booklet that I made. Um, I took a course and uh, I made this book a while ago and uh, I was never really happy with it. And I was watching a video the other day about somebody, um, I can't remember who it was, um, but she was saying, how we evolve and um i thought yeah really um i have changed away my ways i've learned a few things and i've sort of found my own style i think so um i found this book that i had made and um, like i said I, I wasn't thrilled with it never felt really like it was um i don't know mine i guess but so anyway i, I decided to go back in and um uh, do some upgrades and change it up to, to what I like. So I'm going to go in and show you, and I'm going to show you a lot of the detail because I think that's where a lot of the changes happen for me. So hope you join me. So on this little book uh, measures about seven by five. And it really has only one signature in here. And it's uh, not a, a junk journal. It's not really a book for uh, keeping notes. It's, I think, more of a paste book. Anyway, um, so um, here it is. It's called Wild at Heart. And um, this is just a collaged page. And I bound it all together with a silk ribbon. And the back has a... Um, Press flower on some old handmade paper and uh, a bit of ink around the edges. Lots of um, frilly edges as you can see. I think there's one, two, three, four, five, five or six sheets, probably six um, pages inside. I'm going to just try and get close, pretty close. Um, so this page flips up. And there is a little bit of a space to write if you really want to. There's a big pocket here. A lot of the theme here is just uh, flowers and birds and, and uh, time. It's a nice little journaling card that's inside of here. And uh, I put ribbon and buttons and ink and different papers. And here <clears throat> is the beginning. There are some words here that are quite faded out um, about uh, getting your wings and flying and uh, um, embracing the world I guess so this little envelope opens up and inside there's more of the poem holding her breath the beauty overflowed gentle touch of wings and again more clocks and paint and bits and on this other side here there's um uh, these birds are faint, quite faint. I like that. And then I've outlined them with a gel pen. There's a bug. More of the verse. And lace on the edges of the page. Down here, there's a little grommet with a piece of um, snug bug, snug, hug, hug snug ribbon, whatever that's called. You all know it. It said she believed she could, so she did. So what happened originally, it was, I found it was really quite dark and uh, I liked it to be brightened a little bit and more, a little more cheerful. So I added a lot of little cheerful things like the buttons and the pink ribbon.
time stood still. So there's another little tag over here on this eye pin. It says love. More little ribbons, more appliques, butterflies. Layers of different papers and uh, notation things. This is cardboard and uh, music paper. Lots of layers. Lots of shadowing. That's what the course was about, shadowing. So, I mm, guess that's what makes it dark. But it does help the pictures to pop. And on this page, again, it's nice little cute buttons. More ribbons, more lace. And uh, a nice bird here. Some doily underneath. And um, it said, Delighted Heart, she was ready. And then I made this little card. Just the puzzle on the back. And that slips in here. And this page, same sort of thing. Lots of laces, lots of layers of lace and um, other uh, material and other um, papers and die cut. And this little uh, button down here and some more pink ribbon. Lots of texture. This one's flat and this one opens up. And there's one more little spot if you want to write. Um, I went over these um, birds with a white gel pen. Help them to stand out and bring some white into it. And then on this page, got more layers. Layers at the top here. And this is, uh, says be the exception. And this is a big pocket. And in here I have a book postcard. That's just a little thing that's tucking in there. I have a few little things that I can I can tuck in there um, if I want to. That's just my that's my card. White Raven. And then anyway, there we are at the center of the book. And then onto this page, I've added this little bit of screwed up raffia with a little old uh, safety pin. Little poem in behind here. Another clock. These things have been appliqued on top, glued on top. Just the pages and some little buttons. And this little ticket comes out. And then this page here. Just time. And then this page here. More clocks, more flowers, more ribbon, more layers, more die cuts. This is one of my favorites. It's hard on the edge, so it gets kind of takes quite a beating. A little butterfly, corrugated cardboard, a bit of tape measure. And oh, in another antique pin and then the last or second to last page here another clock applicate on there glued on there a little belly band little card stuck in pretty hey I think I found that the brown that I had used was too dark, deep, you know, black brown. And I went with more of this um, reddish tan brown. And I added that in. And I think that helped a lot to 
bring it together and uh, And here's this final page, another button. There's a button here too. Use your wings. Find the magic. And more layers. And birds and butterflies. And of course, this is my favorite. That says um, a little girl standing right there with the back, back facing us and it says, what if I fall? Oh, but my darling, what if you fly? So lots and lots of layers, lots of neutral color. Lots of layers here. Layers and layers and layers. Look at that one page. All those layers. And then on the very back cover, a big tuck spot here and a uh, postcard remember to write home and there's just an old antique postcard that goes in there and back to the back so I I like it better I like it more now that's for sure um, I'm happier with it, I guess. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed it. There is another one, the original. I do have a posting for it if you would like to see it. And you can see the, you know, the before and after if you care to. I'll put the link in the description. So thanks so much for joining me. I uh, really appreciate your time. I hope you're all enjoying the fall. And um, I see a lot of people are doing their, you know, seasonal work. So... I thought this would be kind of nice because of the, the colors of it. But, you know, all through the years, we have to remember to believe in ourselves and uh, use your wings. Okay, thanks again. And uh, it's Jackie from White Raven, the book rock on Vancouver Island. Thanks again. Take care of yourselves. We'll see you in the next time.